What's up, guys? I got five picks to win 5K. Five picks, $5,000. So my play is going to be on Jock Marcus, and this is a kind of new sports book. It works kind of like prize picks, but there's a ton of profitable bets on Jock Market. Um, also, they give you a $100 deposit match. If you don't have Jock Market yet, sign up. It takes literally 60 seconds. Sign up, get the $100 deposit match. You can use my refer friend. Promo code is just my name, Alex. You'll get 100 bucks for free, and I have five amazing prop bets for tonight, including a play on Caleb Martin. This may be our last day betting on the NBA this season, unfortunately. But regardless, five really good picks. Let's make some money. So I've explained this before for prize picks, but Jock Market, if you look at their payout structure, they actually just like, they literally copied prize picks. They have the exact same payouts as prize picks. But I've explained in other videos, prize picks is a fixed payout platform, right? Any five picks you select, you take overs, unders, whatever, you're always getting the same payout. So if you reverse engineer the payouts of prize picks, which I did because it's fun, is you're going to see on prize picks, you have to win 54.25% of your prop bets to be profitable. Any player props winning above 54.25% of the time are going to be profitable on prize picks and on Jock Market. But again, that doesn't mean um, that you only want to have one of them. Them just because they work the same way. Like I've explained before, all these books, No House Advantage, Jock Market, Hot Streak, Prize Picks, they all have different lines from one another. So you can see on Jock Market right now, there's a ton of green, right? On Jock Market, ton of green, ton of profitable bets. You look at No House Advantage, there's no profitable bets. There's no place in green. So the more books you have, the better. But long story short, like the way these platforms get you is think about it. If you have no edge, you have no advantage, no edge, you're going to win 50% of your picks, you're going to lose 50%. But what these platforms are saying, what Prize Picks and Jock Market are forcing you to do is win, say, 55% of your picks, only losing 45% of your picks if you want to turn a profit. And most people just can't do it. Most sports bettors, they're not smart enough. They're not sophisticated enough to win 55% of their picks, only losing 45%. So 54.25%, it may seem easy, but it's not. You got to win 55, only lose 45% of your picks if you want to make money. So how do we do that, right? So what this tool does, I find a lot of my bets on this fantasy optimizer, fantasy, fantasy optimizer, pretty simple. And typically I just look at a bunch of different platforms is it really uses sportsbook odds to show you prop bets that are winning above 55 or 54.25% of the time. So all of these plays are profitable on jock market. So you're going to see Logan Webb over five and a half hits allowed, right? All of the sports books, this is 56% to win. So it's profitable in a jock market entry. Why didn't I play this on prize picks? Prize picks doesn't even have a line on Logan Webb. You're not even going to see Logan Webb. This play isn't on prize picks. It's only on jock market. But if you take a look, like this should make sense. All of the sports books, right? They're all data points. Follow the data. You're not smarter than the sports books. These books have invested hundreds of millions of dollars in their ability to set lines. And they're all telling you the same thing. They're all aligned. There's no discrepancies. There's slight discrepancies from book to book. They all have slightly different models. You know, they're taking slightly different bets, but they're all telling you the same thing. Yo, Logan Webb, he's heavily favored to go over five and a half hits allowed, right? All of the sports books have his over. Heavily favored around like minus 150, minus 160, minus 162, whatever. All the books are telling you, yo, this guy's a lot more likely to go over as opposed to under, right? So the over is winning 56% of the time. So all this fantasy optimizer does, right, is it uses sports book odds. We know all the sports books are telling us, yo, Logan Webb's a lot more likely to go over as opposed to under. But all this fantasy optimizer does is actually quantify for you the win probability, right? And we know any plays winning above. 54.25% of the time are profitable in a prize picks entry. So I literally found all my picks on this betting tool and I'll show you them here in a second. We're going to make $5,000. I'm, uh, I'm a fan. So here you can see my five picks to make $5,000 on Jock Market. Again, get as many of these platforms as possible. The more sports books you have, more profitable betting opportunities you'll have. Never know where the value is going to be. Let's make some money.